Hello people, Prime Sue here. And the wait is over. The um, expected review is here. Now I know some of you, I know some of you I saw it in the group where they're raising eyebrows and uh, behaving funny because of the delay and the seemingly neglect. Um that's normal, that's normal, but what um, what what I really found interesting was the fact that you could notice a break in um, a change in pattern, a change in attitude, or the expectation wasn't met, but nobody was, nobody had the courage, nobody had the, the thought of, the, okay, to check on this guy, what's up, what's happening. This is the first time we're experiencing this. Hope it's well with you. Nobody did, and I get it, I fully do. As well, as women, as humans, it's our natural instinct to think or forget about ourselves. All right. So let's get to this. Right in tax form. So um, the question says, you and some friends ate a meal at a restaurant to celebrate a special occasion, and you are very pleased with the food and service. Write a letter to the restaurant manager. In your letter, give details of your visits to the restaurant. Explain the reason for the celebration. Say what was good about the food and the service. Write at least 150 words. You don't need to write any address. Begin your letter with yes or, or mom. And um, checking my records, the first person to submit is. Um, Uzo Amaka. Uzo Amaka, how are you? Okay. Oh, later says, and yes, sir, I'm writing to inform you how. Let me zoom this. I'm writing to inform you how. I and my friend acquaintance we visit, uh, visited the eatery to celebrate my birthday, and um, we engaged. We enjoyed every meal, service, and services rendered. I was, I've always heard about the restaurant to do. This is at do. Odo has an L. And your S should be bigger. I just want through this. You should be bigger. This is a capital letter I because there's no dot. This, so this, this is a mark off. This is a mark off. This is there's a third one. This is another mark. This is another loss of score. So be careful with your writing. On Thursday, you'll be using a pencil, so um, it will be easier for you to make corrections, but uh, while practicing. While practicing, make sure you you take caution and write as if you're on Thursday. Okay, I've always heard about the restaurant or do, which is what you meant. I walk through here every day when going. Dot your eyes, dot your eyes. You don't do that. And coming back from work because it is a bit close to my work place. I've never bothered to pay visits or even take a walk inside and see what it looks like. But on this special day, we had it written on the place to go, and the eatery was mentioned. And we all agreed on it. On this special occasion, which is my birthday, I really wanted it. Why this comma? I really wanted it to be to be together. I only wanted it to be a remarkable one with my friends. It's been, not it's been, it's been, IT, then um, apostrophe, then S. It's been a while I celebrated my birthday, but on this very one, I swore I wouldn't miss it. Your eye is a consistent miss of the pair. Uh, you constantly miss your dots when you write your eye, the small letter I. Take note. When I swore I wanted to miss it, 
for anything because it's not it's because it's it's it and this is a cap this is a this is a this is a formal letter because you're not writing you're not writing to your friend you're writing to the restaurant manager so it's a formal letter you are using so it is because it is like for then for this one it should be it has been not it's been it has been it has been a while right but on this very one i swear i wouldn't miss it for anything because it is my 20th birthday my friends and i got to the venue and the kind of aroma and the warm welcome we received made me realize i have been missing a lot not patronizing yeah, i like the way you do this with all you did the other um i have no in full instead of have like uh, we were salivating okay the mail already said other oh, customer alone throws i ordered for cake i ordered for cake pastries food and drinks there should be a full stop here i ordered for cake pastries food and drinks full stop then we ate to our satisfaction the food were tasty and delicious that i didn't miss <laughs> this is for my letter this is another where you lose you lose mark for this this is for you you do this only for informal letter read them um, you should take time to go back to the course you will notice how where how i iterated that point but i didn't miss taking some home the waiters were nice and well mannered they were they were beautiful smile throughout our stay we were given the right attention and it really made me feel at home i made my day in my row one that i wouldn't mm, 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 that i will not i will not forget so easily thanks just faithful so what you need is just your tone you need to correct is majorly your tone you still use a you still use an informal tone when it's a formal letter and then um, see your eyes penetration is um will lose you a lot of points now for the positive side you did very well because because you you i mean okay good all right so you talked about of course you made your first paragraph was on the topic which you did here then um you talked about you gave your details about your visits which you did here and the next one you explained the reason for celebrating what well, you did here then you went for you went for that to answer the next paragraph answer to see how the food and service was about which we did here so for, for, for tax them achievements great vocabulary nice but um, for grammar and punctuation not great and coherence of coherence equation is beautiful also because you follow the structure that um, is recommended all right so that um, generally that's a that's that's a good one just improve on your punctuations and also take note of your tone the tone you're using no abbreviation for a formal letter or you can abbreviate for a for an informal letter all right so the next person here this is a person to be sure of you i mean stella stella how are you still not feel like a very very like someone like thank you been here since last year i'm not mistaken oh, this is d okay dear sir i write this later to express my pleasure and tell my experience in your restaurant 
and its services. My friend and I visited your restaurant last week, Saturday at 4.30 p.m. We are served, okay, we are seven in numbers and we sat at the right end of the hall. All right. This hall. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Calculating, counting your number of words. Okay. So you should be up. You should have to work fifteen. You should be up to work fifteen. All right. I like your handwriting is bold. Yeah, I like your handwriting is bold. To give you less issues on Thursday, we were at your restaurant to celebrate our friend Lucy, who just turned 40 this February. Mm -hmm. February is the proper now, should be capital letter. Yeah, all names of uh, the month capital letter, the way you made Lucy capital letter, right? She did not want a big party, so we have friends just organized. We you should be a Komoye and a Komoye so that there'll be a break in the in reading. But you could do it, you could put this in brackets. We are friends. It's all it's it, and that's how you write this. She did not want a big party, so we because you're explaining the we who is the we you put a Komoye and a Komoye so you know we her friends just organize a surprise party for her at your restaurant. We also celebrated another friend Jane and uh a husband on the seventh wedding anniversary. That's beautiful. I like your explanation. Very touching. It was fun. It was a fun field evening as we were able to catch up with old friends and lots of gist. You make a good writer. Of your way. Yeah. The best part of the evening was the food we were served. Okay, the best part of the evening was the food we had served. It was very delicious and nutritious. We must have the best. We must have the best cooks, as I must say. The food was very tasty and well presented. I must not fail to comment. No, no, no. Just you comment, not comment. I must not fail to comment your staff. Comment your staff. They, this is tea. This tea is, uh, 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 I won't subscribe to this tea. Not, this is not a standard tea. This, this will go, but this will not. This is like, uh, I don't know. They were all very polite and well mannered, smartly dressed, and readily available to take orders and serve the guests. Thank you so much for the excess, for the excellent service. I look forward to visiting again. Best regards, Stella. All right, so Stella, you did the um, same like with um, Uzamaka. You followed the structure, which is good. Though I was concerned about your number of words, but you discovered it's up to 150, and that's good. You, yeah, this is a good one. This is a good one. Just this February, and uh, what else? That you notice and the comment that you make the writer's comments. So good one. What's next? This should be synergy. I know some of the hundred is already exactly. Exactly. I just know. So which of them is this? Pie chart. This should be no, 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 no,
two tables. So this one is not it. You know, it's going to say Mishnah. Okay, this is it. All right. The tables show data on the says fair table, fair trade, and bananas in UK, Switzerland, Denmark, Belgium. Good one overall. Overall, coffee sales increased in all five countries from 1994 sales of banana and only went up in the in the three in three out of in three out of the five countries. Which countries? The question is about sales. Of fair trade labor coffee brand brand 1999 four. So you have to do a comparison with both. It's the same countries to crop. So sales of coffee in United Kingdom will dramatically from one. Well, coffee sales increase in all five countries. From 1999 to 2004, sales of banana only went up in the in three out of the four five countries. Um, you'd have said um, in all countries except two countries, so they know. You know so they know because these are big us. You cannot tell what it is. You have to. You need to make the. You have to make this not come here and do the research and so no. So you just say. But I only went up in went up in all countries except the countries that didn't go up in. Sales of coffee in United Kingdom grew dramatically from 1.5 million, yes, to 20 million in and making it the highest and making it the highest in 2004. Coffee sales in Switzerland, which was highest in 1999, doubled to 6 million euros to become the second highest sold in 2004. Denmark, Belgium, and Sweden have slightly increased in their sales between the stated period. From one point zero two million. <laughs> you just give, you're, you're like you're vomiting the food data here. You should just keep relationship like give relationship, not just pour the exact figures. Because you look at the summarize. For you to summarize information by selecting and reporting the main features and make comparison. Understand? So, Denmark, Belgium, and has slightly increased in their between. So, what would have what you would have done instead was just um. Let me check the stats. Point that source. Can I please give me a second? Okay. Denmark, Belgium, and Sweden had slightly increased in their sales between the stated period. That would be enough. Instead of omitting the whole entire, uh, entire figures. On the other hand, Switzerland recorded the highest value in sales. In banana, the sales of banana in 1999 with million euros and why greatly increased over 7 million ton and four. Banana sales also increased in Belgium and UK. With Belgium residing in with Belgium rising in sales from 0 0.6 in 1999 to 4 million ton and four. It's increased in size structure. It's Oh, is that? okay. It increased in UK from 1 million in 1999 to 5.5 in euros. 5.5 million euros in turnover for making it the second highest. And Denmark and Sweden and Denmark different. Deferred from the other three countries with a decline. Good. The former reduced from 1.8 million. 
why the latter in letter reduced okay overall coffee good now is the even spread of your points is the thing that, that, that gives me concern here yeah. you give a go you give an overall And you give a detailed of this table one. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. So what's in that chain? Um, one thing I I like about your stuff is you don't you really make any grammar error or stuff like that. None of that. And that's good. That's good. The only challenge is to your relationship, your um, point of relationships. You just have most of the times you just vomit all the details out, like you did here, and most of it's here. What you'd have done is break. This is how you broke this. Of our coffee, we talk about our coffee. We talk about the sales here. You've done the same for banana. Then having a huge block of text here. Alright? Because now more attention here. Some coffee, two paragraphs, and only one for your banana. When general it's good, at least you met the you met the requirements. And yeah, this is more than 50 words. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. It's more than already. Yeah, it's more than. So you're safe on that fact. You're safe on that. All right. So who's the next? I'm not going to address those other ones because we've done them in the past. You missed it, sorry. Who's this person? Let me do your writing. Who is this? Saki Simon. Mrs. Simon, it's been a. How are you? Okay, someone has issue here. Yeah. Kemi. My. Uh, is writing tax. In writing tax, the only thing I my tax too is a major challenge. Nothing comes to mind when I'm supposed to write. I change the nation. Wait. Um, nothing comes to mind. I think you are. You, you've. Yeah, this is not Thursday yet, so I'll say pressure. But uh, something should come to mind. Something should come to mind. There are major ways you can do this. Majorly by... Uh, majorly, majorly by... It has, if it has happened to you, the fault, past experience, movies, there's no tech, there's no okay. In the next this is your coming week, we're working on tax two as I'm good. The tax element of on tax two, so um we will better relate with this by that time. All right, so let's just leave it to them. So Simon, how are you? Which is Simon? I'm writing to express my what is it, uh, utmost satisfaction concerning the dishes served uh, at your restaurant as well as the warm service rendered to I and my friends during our celebration at your restaurant. Let me point this out. In English, if you ask, if you want to say you don't, you actually you start with 
saying I and my friends. It's really my friends and I, not not I and my friends. For <coughs> for something good, something great that's beautiful, like this case is my friends, my friends and I, not I and my friends. Now, if it's for a case where yeah, when you or something not good, maybe crying or something, you say, I am my friends, like you put yourself in arm's way. That's the way it's done. So um, when you write it next time, please use my friends and I, not I am my friends, my friends and I doing a bad doing a uh, uh, doing a celebration at your restaurant. I was at your eatery in the com I can see this so company of some of okay company of some of my friends on the 23rd of January. At first we were in this is about taking the VIP lunch because I assume it is very expensive. I guess you emitted we because you assume it's very expensive. Very expensive, judging from the appearance of the restaurant until one of us, your staff convinced us to stay. Are you serious? Oh, wait. To stay. Okay, maybe I missed one. Let me check if it's telling you. Okay, I missed it. To stay at the large, at the lounge as its best fit, education we are celebrating and not as expensive as we, as we thought. Past tense. Twenty-five is symbolic number in my culture. It is the set to mark the beginning of new and exciting things to come in one's life. My younger and sister turned twenty-five on the twenty-third. January and entire to celebrate her birthday with friends. Choosing as well as one of the best decisions I made that day. Recently, I had not seen a restaurant that has better of dishes as yours. I was amazed at the time. I, at the time, I tasted the food we ordered and cannot see what was wrong with the food. Unlike other restaurants. Everything was perfect. The hospitality. Wait the next paragraph. Come on. Mm -hmm. Everything was perfect. Despite what offered to us by your staff was second to none. They they went con they went constantly. They were constantly asking whether we are having a nice time and they did not hesitate to attend to us at each beacon at each beacon okay the food was so tasty and delicious the amount of pepper <laughs> the amount of pepper added to the dishes was perfect it was okay it was perfect i'm grateful for this service right now all right go on we are talking about pepe. I thought I was thinking of your robot. No, yeah, uh, we are pepe champions. Okay. Okay. No way. So your first. You talked about location, you get to the visit, you explain the reason, and you say how good it was. So great. You follow the structure, nice. And your tone was good. Yes, very good. Tone was very good. Just started. Your sentences were very long. And that's why it was, it was hard for me to read. So this is a very long. No, I'm not supposed to be there. The sentences were very long, but it was hard for me to read. 
take for this one. Take this one example, we went from all year down to this point for the first tended. So I like it to be hard same with same with high be hard for your examiner to read also because it's very long. So try and shorten your sentences to help you. And um, that said, great. Who's next? Okay, let me see. Tax one. Rosalyn, how are you? Dear friend, no, 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 no. This is not the assignment for today. This is not the assignment. This was this was for Papa. We can have done this one. Um, um Amarachi. Okay. Yes, sir. I write to express my satisfaction about the food and services given to me and my friends last time we visited your restaurant. It was a good one, and I must commend you for that. Good. On 6th January, 6th January at about 2 p.m., we entered into your restaurant to have lunch. The whole place was neatly arranged. There was a background music playing, which, which was so Attaining, to so attaining. What do you mean? What do you mean attaining? Or all this all entertaining you meant? There, yeah, there was orderly flow. There was orderly flow as customers were being attended to. Where's the full stop? We left at the restaurant. It was my uncle's 25th wedding anniversary, slash Silver Jubilee. It's my is all. Oh, God. Which I think is the full stop. I'm going to drop a full stop and make it clear. There, there was delay during church service at the exchange and my travels, the place to. Please took time to be able to, and uh, we are so hungry and tired to have lunch before going for the reception. Hmm, why this is nice, but the fact is, give details of your visits. Give details of your visits. This was in church, not in the restaurant. What I like most in your restaurant, details of your visits. That was before the visit, or things that happened before the visit. So it's not really, it doesn't really answer the question. What I liked most in your restaurant was the neatness of the environment. The staff were neat and cheerful. The food was so delicious and really served. You guys are making me hungry. All delicious food everywhere. The food was so delicious and orderly served. One of my friends had to order a second plate. I so much like the serving. I so much like the servicing and right for you to keep it up. I'll always keep in touch anytime around. Yes, sincerely. All right. Um, first and first, your letter is all jammed together. And you have a very bold and writing which makes so it's kind of like um hard to flow through. In this situation, you should really give one at least once one um uh, once a uh, free once one line before you move to the next paragraph. So you can easily you can easily indicate which with the paragraphs. Like this was very confusing. This was very confusing. We don't know which paragraph is if this if this is one part if this this one paragraph or ten day the we don't know. So and, you should, and since you are indebted, this is a paragraph, keep to that indentation. Right? Then for, but for the letter itself, it's good, it's great. Format on well kept. And uh, little omission of words. I think there was no, I didn't notice anyone. It's omission of words and uh, yeah, great. Just for this one, I didn't answer the question right this first time. 
this paragraph is answer. Or you were mentioning things, you really answered the question. It was not really, that's, 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 that's an irrelevant part of the program. This is of your visit to the restaurant, not um, outside, not before coming to the restaurant, your visit to the restaurant. All right? So who's next? You should give your name now. Okay. This is this, this last this, this last week assignment. This is last week assignment. Sorry. This is the wrong one. This is a, this is the wrong one. Okay, so that's the end of it. Now I promise someone to answer a particular question. Let's start. All right. Comfort and then uh, Please, when you when you are snapping your picture, don't do it this way. It's I can't see this. This is actually difficult. I'm straining my eyes. What is that? I'm looking at his computer screen to do this. And I'm going to finish. I'm having a headache because of I'm straining my eyes to see. So do it do it the way. Uh, let me give an example. No, I don't want this, something like this next time. I want something like this vertical. Like put the book flat. Then use your phone. Make it flat. Then put your phone. Flat like this and snap. All right. Good. So let's uh, let me hit the. Mm. Okay, Christine. Yes, it was Christine. I promised our address. Yeah. So Kristen said, good morning, sir, please. I noticed that after read practicing listening with the past questions, I also went back to reading questions again. I did not do well like I did when I was practicing reading. It's like I forgot some techniques in reading. Is there a strategy to remember this? Like I'm discouraged. Okay. Um, there's so much to cram. There's so much to cram. Yeah, uh, it seems so. It seems so. It seems there's so much to cram. I wouldn't agree with that. Your observation is so much to cram. Now, that's the first step. That's one way to do it. One way to master the senses to cram. But that's not the best. The best is to master. And when we master, I mean, you just it should um, come from practice. The way you do it is this: you reading, you definitely forget because uh, you left it. It's just like. Uh, yeah, you left it like everything in life. When you leave something for a while, it leaves you too. All right, so it's normal. Now, the way it is, practice as often as you can. Practice. In reading generally, all you need to know, note keywords. If you can note keywords, note keywords, note keywords, know how to scan, know how to scheme. Yes, that's really, that is the fundamental not know how to note keywords, know how to note easily note keywords, they know how to scan, how to scheme. Because scan and scheme is not is not uh, is not that what most people teach, just scan and scheme, but that's not really that's not all. If you can note keywords, you can easily note key, this is the keywords, these are the keywords, then you can use the keywords to search for the answer fast in the read in the passage. But forgetting it, it's gonna be like that if you don't practice as often. As possible. Why don't you make this an illusion? That's how I expect everyone of any one of you to practice. Make it a leisure. Don't don't see it as practice. Your spare time. Your spare time when you want to relax. Use that form of relaxation. Form of relaxation. Just pick it up and just do one. All right. Just one of the reading, or you take one of the, you just put your earpiece or play the audio of listening and why you do it. Take it as leisure. Don't see it as work. Take it as leisure. You just have to change your perspective. And with that, you can practice often as much as possible. All right? So um, any other question? Please, uh, can I, the past question? Oh, I can't have access to the past question. That's a marriage. Please, can you guide me? Is the guide on the, I've listened and followed the instructions. Then you should get it now. Everybody has it. 
if you follow the instruction you should have it there's a link there and I sh uh, that's in Coursera and I showed you how to there's a video in the Coursera watch it in that video I told you I told you how to download the past questions into your phone mind you you have to start studying study from IS 7 and above don't use from 1 to 6 that's that's old IS all right that's old IS so use them just 1 to from 7 and above and you'll be fine well, okay, you can buttress what exact thing, the exact challenge you have, right? Okay, a boss said, he says, good morning, our coach. As for me, I'm, I'm, I have an exam in nursing program, which is my first semester. I will be doing much in the assignments. Please pardon me, I beg. I want to concentrate on the first, then I will join with full force by April. Well, yeah, I agree. Yeah, I agree. That's my month. I have my birthday month. So. All right. So um, that's it for this review. Important updates you should take. You should um, take note of. Everybody should join the Facebook group. Everybody, something big is coming. I'm announcing. I'm going to be doing that in the Facebook group. So everybody, if you're not in the Facebook group, yet, join, 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 join. Join the Facebook group. Very, very important. Um, I'm thinking of having live Q and A sessions. Yeah, so like uh, to be live because this is like um, I have to do recording. I have to do a recording. You have to ask. I do a recording. No. So I'm thinking of doing like I'm thinking of starting a live sessions with everybody where I'll be live. You can ask your questions and answer it directly, and you can give instant feedback. That kind of that that's not possible on Telegram. That's possible on Facebook. So everybody join the facebook the group. join the facebook group go back to your course there's a link to the facebook group join and the second big update is this i have been working tirelessly the past two weeks to make something big come your way and that is getting top jobs in canada mm -hmm. yep yes so it's 90 percent ready it's 90 percent ready and that's why I want to join the Facebook group because I've been the big announcement. I've been the big announcement there. When I mean top jobs, I mean top jobs. Jobs that pay as much as 100 USD per annum. That 36.27.5 million plus that can be a dollar, not USD. All right. So join everybody. Join the face. Everybody join the Facebook group. Something big is launching there, and uh, see you. I'm going to post the. I'm going to post the uh, the next assignment in the in the in the assignment channel, and I'll add a link under this video for that for to to a link to the channel there. All right, everybody. Um, okay, let's leave it there. We'll continue from the coaching conversation in the Facebook group. Cheers. I'm trying to see you again. Love you.